Today I'm going to do a very important routine maintenance on the outboard engine. It's going to be greasing all the moving parts outside of the uh, engine so we can get all that lubricated which is very important. And I'll show you where those oil intakes are located. There's several grease intakes. There's one here. There's another one here on this side. And Okay, there is another one right up here, which it greases this shaft here, all the way to the bottom. And there's another one here, and a couple on the other side, which we can reach it from up here. And on this side, there's another one right here too. All right, so this is the marine grease that I use. I used it in all my boats, trailer applications uh, for the salt water environment. And I'm gonna have to change the cartridge in the grease gun because I just ran out. And very important, get some gloves because this is gonna be a little messy sometimes when you're dealing with grease. First of all, what I do is open this up a little bit here. That way you get some air in there. Okay, so all the way up. Now I'm gonna open this up here. See the tube is empty. I'm gonna take the old cartridge out. And now what we want to do is remove this cap. And I'm gonna place it. Now remove the top. Roll your grease back here. And screw the bottom part to the top. Okay, that's perfect. Now what I want to do is release the pin. Okay, that's it. If you look now, the gun will be ready to be pumping out. See, perfect. All right, so this is a very important area is to grease the shaft here. And before I grease that shaft, I want to clean that old grease from the factory. So that way I don't get any debris from the outside, any dirt. Keep pumping until you see some oil coming out of the bottom or the top. In this case, oil will come out on the bottom here and also come out on the top here. And you'll see it now coming out. Okay, you see the factory oil coming out? That's perfect, that means the oil already reached the top already. All right, now we have two greasing ports, one here, one here. All right, in this case, it looks like there's rust right inside the port here. So the grease has not been able to go in. It's like sealed. So, okay, so it looks like this pin here is completely shut. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get a small screwdriver and a hammer and just tap it gently on the back. As you can see now, the port is open now. So you may have to do that if it's rusted out a little bit. Okay, now it's going in. So it's good to leave a little bit of oil right on top of the valve so that way you don't get that rust spot there again. Now I'm moving to the one in the back here. Okay, that's it. You can see the grease coming out right here. It's perfect. Perfect. And I'm going to repeat the process on the other side. 
and I also grease up here to these stainless steel rods. Okay, one last one is right back here. It's hitting right under here. You see right there when I'm touching my finger? That you can reach from the bottom of the uh, C Star hydraulic system. All right, so that's how you grease up the outboard. That way you have a better steering on your boat and your sea star system doesn't work that hard it's a very important routine maintenance it's been about a year and about 100 hours and i have not done that to the engine so it's very important it's already due for it so now the engine is going to tilt and move around freely especially using the autopilot uh, which it moves the engine a lot so that's perfect and the oil I use, I will place the link in the description below and also the grease gun. Um, if you don't have one, you can guide yourself and get that one or get some other ones. Alright, so if you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. Thank you for watching and navigate safe.